Credit to Trinity. They have a great team. They did a great job. They're really well coached. Number 20 is a heck of a player. Um, so first off, credit to them. That's uh, They did a, a great job. Um, and uh, our young women did phenomenal. They battled back. They didn't get discouraged. Really proud of them and their fight. And uh, most importantly, just proud of the way they love each other and they care about each other out there. And, uh, you know, we talk all the time. If you leave your heart on the floor, then you win. And uh, win or lose, that's what we did. And we're really happy, obviously, to be in this situation. But either way, our kids play hard till the end. And we're just, uh, I'm just not humbled to coach them and honored. Uh, Mara, what's the biggest challenge tonight that you guys overcame that you're kind of proud of that leaving tonight's game? Um, I would just say, you know, it was a battle the entire game. They'd go up by four or three or two, and then we'd battle back and make it even, and then they'd, you know, kind of get ahead. But we just stayed together as a team, and I was just really proud of how, like Coach said, we just really play because we want to keep playing. We want to stay the same team and just keep on going. So we kind of overcame that and uh, did a really great job. Okay, um, just um, leading into tonight's game, I'm sure you guys have been in tough games like this. So just how prepared were you in that moment whenever three minutes were remaining in tight ball game? Just what, what enabled you guys to pull tonight out? Uh, you know, I think we've had a, co a few tough games. Like in our league, we had a pretty tough non-conference game. We had a few close ones in league. Um, it was kind of nice playing a new team this time. I think we really liked, you know, getting a fresh start. But I think what really helped us pull it off is just like Mara said, we play together as a team really well. We have really good chemistry. We kept our composure. We trust each other to mm -hmm. win, and uh, it didn't matter who was making that last basket. You know, we trusted each other to pass the ball, and we just stayed together. I think that's really what pulled it off. Yeah. Okay, and so tonight's exciting. You got the win, but I mean, quick turnaround tomorrow you play again. So just what's the message for your team uh, leading into tomorrow's game? Yeah, you know, um, the message is we, we kind of live day by day, hour by hour here. So our first goal is just to get back to the hotel, get some rest, and then we'll be ready to go for tomorrow. And we're excited about the opportunity to keep competing. Um, survive in advance is what March is about. So our, our message to the team is always the same. Defense, rebounding, play with your heart, leave it on the line, and, and just enjoy the experience. That's what we're going for. Any additional questions? I have a question for you. Third yeah. year in a row in the NCAA tournament. How does yeah. it feel to, to break the door down and get that first yeah. first round of win? Yeah, it feels great. You know, it's interesting because um, kind of the people that have experienced it for three years with me, the juniors and then sophomores with two and stuff, we all kind of said that this year just felt a little different. Like the past years we were kind of happy to be here, but this mm -hmm. year we had uh, business to take care of and uh, we still do. So um, it's been it feels good to get the W, but we're, uh, we're excited to continue. So, yeah, thanks for the question. Um, you know, the, the the game was what you would expect it to be at this level. Both teams had really, really good uh, game plans. I thought both teams did a great job executing those game plans. Anytime you get to this point in the season, it's going to come down to making huge plays and huge moments. And we made a handful, but they certainly made some incredible shots down the stretch to get just enough separation to keep the game out of reach. Um, you know, so hats off to them. Um, I thought their players stepped up. but. You know, it's tough when you're, when you're the coach of, of a senior class that's as important to you as this one, um, not to take anything away from the rest of our team. Uh, th these girls have laid the foundation for a culture that we're extraordinarily proud of at Trinity. And, and that, that definitely permeates through our entire roster of players. So, you know, when you stand here in this moment, it's really difficult to think about not coaching these kids again. Um, I love them. That's the truth. And uh, I could, couldn't put it into words how proud I am of them. So... Caitlin, just talk a little bit about tonight's game and just the season in general, just how proud of you are of the effort tonight in general. Yeah, um, I mean, we definitely had a game plan coming in, and I thought we really battled to the last minute. It was a rough game. Like Cam said, they made some big plays when they had to, but um, I'm, I'm never disappointed in the way we play. I think we went out there and left it all on the floor, and it just didn't work out for us tonight, but they have a good foundation, like you said. Same question. I'm just proud of the way we way we came out. We came out strong, just came up a little short in the end, but happy that we got this far. Open it up. Any questions? Coach, it, uh, Caitlin especially came out and hit a couple of clutch threes, but um, talk a little bit about the three-point shooting overall from your perspective and from their perspective. You know, it's funny. Um, in a game like this, I don't, I don't even look at the box score when it's over. You know, it's it's so much more about celebrating your kids and the, and the team. I mean, three-point shooting is a factor in every game. Um, you know, they clearly had a game plan to eliminate our three-point shooting. We kind of had a similar game plan, and they broke loose a little bit late and threw a couple in that were really important. Um, I don't think it was a lack of defensive intensity on our part. I think they were just big shots. Um, you know, but that's going to be a key in any game. Uh, 
So, you know, from that standpoint, I mean, I, I call it a wash. I don't know what the stats say, but I know we didn't get the looks that we're typically, you know, used to getting. Um, so that's a credit to their defense.